You know, we switched places. Yeah, it's weird. It's weird. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, much better. Woo! So much better. <laughs> now it's let's like, do who it. Who is this person I'm seeing? I know. Like that, I am not used to seeing the other side of your face. Them. I mean, they're both very pretty. See, that's your the example face. of something <laughs> nice to say. No, about you. I said, it looks this, and you're like, yeah, they're both very pretty, because I just said that. That was talking about you! Okay, yeah, this is it's actually a perfect example of what's going on here, because we're going to talk about two times that I said something, and what was going on in my brain came out differently in my mouth, and then they got me in trouble. Story time! Yep, story time. So, we're in New York. I am jobless. Kim has a job. This was a long time ago. Yeah, Kim's working for Inside Edition. I am working, but they're not using me, and I'm so like I'm the house elf. Nice. So I clean up the apartment, and I do all the laundry, and I get the dishes done. You know, try to, and then I watch a lot of TV when lots uh, of TV. Yeah, mostly when that gets done, because this was during the birth of the DVR. So I got through like 800 shows. She gets home, and the laundry is still in the basement. We're in her apartment in New York, and I remember her just being like, "Honey, where's the laundry?" And I was like, I did not say it like that. I was like, like where? I mean, I, like I was gonna go work out. Like, where are my clothes? Like, where are they? Exactly like I just said it. And so, <laughs> what I meant to say was, as I like walked out the door, was, "You'll be sorry when I'm dead," which is a super dramatic thing to say like, to somebody. No, he said, like, "You'll you, be sorry when I'm dead." That's what I no, meant. No, you meant to say, "You'll be sorry when I'm gone," or something like yeah. that. Yeah. What I actually said was. You'll be sorry when you're dead. You're gonna be sorry when you're dead. And then I slammed the door and walked out. Got back up and Kim was like, um, um, did you just threaten to kill me? <laughs> and, so, and then we diffused the tension by me saying, no, that's not what I meant to say. And we kind of laughed it off, but that's a horrible thing to say to someone. I figured you didn't mean to tell me, like if you were just gonna kill me, you would just do it. You wouldn't like tell me first. The reason we're telling you this story is because last night, um, I was uh, preparing meat for a shish kebab. I was with my brother, he was over here, and I meant to say, hey honey, we'll cut this outside by the grill, that way I can get out of your way. And instead what I said was, hey, me and Dale are gonna go outside and cut this so that I can get away from you. <laughs> Which I, I think is what he probably meant. I think he probably wanted to get away from me. So I feel like now that I'm hearing this out loud, I feel like what's really happening is you're saying the things you really want to say. So you so thought I wanted to kill you in New York? You, you probably had an urge. No, I did not ever have an urge to kill you. Are you kidding me? I mean, I can't say that. I'm kidding. <laughs> so the question, have you ever accidentally said something like that to your spouse? What was it? And can we laugh at you now? Tell us or you'll be sorry. <laughs> when I find you. <laughs> do wait, hang on. Now that we're at this, like, I feel like I do sort of fit the bill for a really, like, successful serial killer. Like, there, like, aren't all the successful serial killers, like, in their 30s to 40s and, like, white males? Yes, aren't, like, but... Aren't I, like, right down... I'm, like, a true crime nut. Okay. So, one thing that you really... That, that is consistent among most famous serial killers, head injury. Okay. Like, I've had three concussions. There, it's constantly a head injury and some sort of weird relationship with your mom. No, I got a great relationship with my mom. But a head She's injury. upstairs right now in the attic. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so guys, play this video in court if something should ever happen yeah. to me. Also, am I a serial killer? Comment below. <laughs> that went well. Ew, now you're kind of creeping me out. Oh, you'll be sorry when you're dead. Okay, clips, clip, cut, cut the clip. <laughs>